Hi everybody, Mark Allen, Creative Scouts. This is seven things you should know about aftercare for your SMP, long-term and short-term. Let's go. Number one, straight after each treatment session, you wanna keep your scalp dry for up to four days. You may experience a bit of redness, you may experience a bit of an itchy scalp. This is all totally normal and it will subside after a few days. Also, if you want to, you can wear a hat during this process. Just make sure it's something soft and loose and comfortable so it's not gonna irritate your skin whilst it's healing. Number two, healing stages. As the pigment heals under the skin, little tiny scabs may form. And so after two days, you can start to moisturize again and this will really help the healing process. Number three, avoid excessive sweating. Stay away from any saunas, steam rooms, things like this that may cause excessive sweating. We recommend four days, but this can be flexible, seeing on how you feel. You may continue with the gym and exercise if you can refrain from excessive sweating. If you do overly sweat, then just get a paper towel and just block away okay and that should dry it out nicely number four showering washing and getting water on your scalp after four or five days give your scalp a good wash with warm soapy water avoid any strong chemicals such as anti-dandruff shampoos or any hair growth products just for a few days you may start to use these types of products again 10 days after each procedure Number five, medication and alcohol. Yes, you may drink alcohol and take any medications that you need to straight after any treatment. Number six, cutting your hair. You can cut your hair again after day five with clippers or a shaver, whichever is your preferred choice. Just be gentle on the scalp until after the 10 day period. From day 10, after any of your treatments, your scalp is pretty much healed. Number seven, long-term maintenance of your SMP. We ask that you avoid swimming pools, hot tubs, things like this because of the high chlorine level that could possibly affect the color. So just up to 30 days after that, you're totally fine. Keep moisturizing regularly, and most importantly, use a high factor sunscreen, factor 50 preferably, and that will stop any excessive fading that may result from direct sunlight onto your scalp. Okay everyone, thanks for watching. I hope you've learned something about aftercare and SMP. It's really quite simple, okay? Seven things to remember, and if you get your pre-treatment and your post-treatment care exactly right, then you'll be looking forward to some great SMP in the future.